Rays are out of here in Fist Energy Stadium. Even though the economy is a mess in this city, these are some of the best sports fans in the country. I heard things were so bad that Leland Casino was turned into an Indian reservation, Grim. Yeah, why don't you just open a window and take a lake all over the fans? Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The New York Tyrants go up against the Leland Burns. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> it's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, hmm. uh, no, nope, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Hey, you idiot. And it's first and ten. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Picked up a lot of real estate in a hurry. Give him 10 yards right there. <laughs> Second down, the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Oh, great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Third down and a pussy here. Hot, hot one, hey. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm, that's bleak. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where Mark... The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, his head just exploded. <laughs> Man, these guys have... And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you, and the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. There aren't too many players that kids can look up to at home. There's no reason to drop the ball if you're still alive. It's going to shave a few days off his life. First down and six. Hot, hot one, hey. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkey skin grafted on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. <laughs> And they line up for the extra point. Oh, 
Arc straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. Boom! And it's first and ten. Defense goal for speed. He can go all the way. The 30. The 20. The 10. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. Is hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. He broke free and has open field in front of him. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. They've used a strawberry field's dirty trick. <laughs> Those guys don't know which way forward is now. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. First down and nine. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and five. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot three. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downest guy than a speed feet prep. He's running from his team. Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. 
four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. Quick pass picks up maybe two yards. Third and four. That pass play was good for three yards. And they'll line up for the punt here. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. No return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball's down. And it's first and ten. How do you like your defense is cooked? The ball carrier is saying, well done. Running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Before he caught it, you gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag! You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. And that pass is good for about five yards. Third down and five. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. First and ten. Man, this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. What speed for the game? What are you trying to impress your nerd fan base to bring him into the game? Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. That's a four yard gain. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a time print. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. And he punched his way out of that tackle. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. They 
called a zap attack. The ball came. Oh, welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Nah, don't call things epic, friend. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. Don't have some fun on your side. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. This is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down and a lot. You've got to catch that. Third down and, well, good luck. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. Nice catch. And it's oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. Second down and five. with a brutal hit. And that's it. That's the last time out. It's score or die from here out. And it's first and ten. And this guy runs angry and runs hard. First down. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot five. Ten yard pickup there. Normally a first down, but here he's just making up ground. Yeah, like the way the 
Kamish makes up news. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass. If you get one more bullshit penalty, you get one more for free. You'll also probably lose the game. Just do the attack ref's dirty trick. <laughs> Second down and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. <laughs> the offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. And that'll bring up third down and inches. Hot one. Hot. Man, what a hit that was. First down and one. Hot one. Hot. Oh, great throw. Great catch. And that puts six points on the board. The defense got the quarterback or actually playing some D. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, I can't believe it ain't the whole thing. Drop, drop, fizz, fizz. Someone give that guy some Balka Schmelzer. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. Welcome back to the start of the second half. It's a close game and should be a battle to the end. The teams line up for the kickoff. And my second half buzz is just kicking in right on time. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. Oh, nice hit. Third down and three. Catch on the play. Every little bit counts. Those three yarders might grow up to be something. 
somebody one day. Second down and seven. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. <laughs> like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. <laughs> This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. He goes, hello now. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. First and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. Second down and ten. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Sonic perfect pass and the score! Hey man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. He caught it. That's two points and even more momentum on their side. I can feel the momentum shifting. For the last time, you're not a Jedi, Bricks. Oh. <laughs> The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and it's first and ten. The defenders want to be just kicked in. And they just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback's going to be hurting or dead.
Second down in a very lot. And he picks up about six on the play. Third down and long. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the ball is... And when you lateral the ball, there's always a chance it's going to be fumbled. Second down and six. And that player just transformed into a giant. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack once today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. <laughs> Third down, and the punter is warming up. I hope he's got a good chiropractor. Well, I hope the kicker ate his bleedies this morning. Straight through the uprights. Looking for a good return after giving a point. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Scrambler. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot, hot, hot. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. He's not just burning down the house, he's taking it to the house. Oh man, he just crushed him. <laughs> I gotta see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in, freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson, he said? That unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you gotta pay attention. Yeah, a lot of the jungle, you know? Hey. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and 10. Hey. Put on a display there. Touchdown. <laughs> and they come to the line trying to tie this up with two points. And if they don't, things are going to get weird. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Wow, two years ago, this guy was a very rotting corpse at the edge of the galaxy. And today, look at him. He's a dancing scoring machine. What a story. What a, what a wonderful story.
The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Hot, hot one. Oh, the strawberry fields dirty trick. As my mentor Hunter used to say, I don't advocate drugs, alcohol, narcotics, or insanity to anyone, but they've always worked for me. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Man, he just laid the wood on him on that one and knocked the ball out. The defense jump. And he's off to the races. He's at the 10. Touchdown. And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's coupon night at Taco Hell. He has better footwork, though, than me. On account of not clenching his cheeks, though. No more Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First 
first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief because there's nothing worse than... Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Third down. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first timeout. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the refs some cash. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. Oh, great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock-blocked the clock. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Not going down, and the quarterback finds his man for the first down. The quarterback burns his last time out. He can't stop the clock anymore. And the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Hot two, hot. heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. Hot, hot one, hot. No one was interested in that incomplete pass. Eh, not a ball's feelings are hurt. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two, three. And that one's incomplete. The receiver couldn't get there. And yeah, neither could his mother. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. They'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck, which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Hot two. Hot. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Hot one. Hot. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score. Well, if you're into humiliation and scatological fetishes, 
This Burns law goes right up your alley. Well, that's a waste of an afternoon if you're a Leland fan. But if you're from Leland, uh, that's what everything feels like, I suppose, so after you. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They should be ashamed of themselves. I know I am. Yeah, you're Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not.